Hello from the southern capital of Russia, Sochi, my dear friends. I arrived at night time and so I stay for one night in a small hotel. Let me show you. Just one room. It's like a guest house with a refrigerator and two beds, but I needed only one. And so and I paid less than 1000 ruble uh, per night. Everything here is uh, rather good. Oh. Yes. It's like apartments. And and now I'm going to uh, look at this grape. Wow, it's breathtaking. <laughs> How many grapes are there? But uh, but it's not ripe yet. Uh, now I'm going to explore the city and I will show you everything possible and everything interesting. Well, look at this house. Oh, we don't have booking, you know, now uh, after sanctions in Russia, but uh, it was worth visiting this guest house, Adel. It's a uh, high um, mark in booking so to tell you the truth it looks like yards in a Soviet Union <laughs> a little bit but a lot of grapes it's so fascinating really fascinating that was my guest house. I don't know where to go and where is the Black Sea here. Uh, maybe you know that Sochi is located on Black Sea, on the coast of Black Sea. Uh, I arrived at night, as I mentioned before, and I took a taxi. Uh, that's why I, I didn't see anything. <laughs> now it's going to be a surprise for me. And for you, for sure, where am I? <laughs> I know that uh, Sochi is one of the most expensive cities in Russia. Uh, maybe, maybe right now we can check some prices. I can see uh, a grocery store. Let's go. Mm, this is not a grocery store. This is a fruit and vegetables department. So let's see. Good watermelons, 28 rubles for kilo. And apples are rather expensive. It's expensive everywhere. 100 rubles, 120 for one kilo. And cabbage, uh, this is a new harvest, 45 rubles for kilo. And eggplants, my favorite one, but I, I don't think it's the, it's local, 90 rubles for kilo, zucchini 50 rubles for kilo, and um, Bulgarian pepper 90 rubles. And let's see, uh, what about tomatoes? Uh, do you remember my videos from Moscow local markets? So I think it's cheaper in Moscow, 125 rubles here for one kilo and 100 so high prices you know but this is a resort uh, 108 rubles for pictures but very soft good and for plums the same price and for this kind of pictures wow look it's just from the tree 180 and this kind of pictures is much more expensive 270 rubles yes 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 and have you seen a lot of grapes near my house so this is a local grape 200 rubles in moscow can buy for 100 rubles uh, and bananas are 105 rubles in moscow i buy it 70 rubles so it's really one of the most expensive cities in russia <laughs> and small pack of onion is 30 rubles 
you know it's sochi and this area is well known with its uh, spices a lot of spices it's really good and smells good I'm going on uh, to explore this this unusual uh, Russian city, Southern, but here it looks like a village. Uh, but uh, maybe you remember, I hope you remember that Sochi was the capital of uh, Winter Olympic Games in 2014. And it was really great. But here, I don't see something extraordinary. Let's go further. I know exactly that Sochi is located on a Black Sea coast. And the owner of um, uh, my guest house uh, told me that uh, Black Sea is not far, about one and a half kilometers. But uh, having gone about two kilometers already, I don't see, I don't see the Black Sea. No, it's not for me, this trek. <laughs> Oh my god, I expected to see the sea and not garbage. Where is the sea? I'd like to swim a little bit. Guys, can you help me? I don't know where to go. I know people. Walking around Sochi, I see a lot of... Uh, a lot of announcements about... Uh, you can rent a room here, room apartment, room or apartment, uh, and it's everywhere. Russian people are used to rent apartments, not to buy nights in uh, in the hotel. This is the endless street. <laughs> I am. I still don't know where am I. And I don't want to rent a room here. It's so far from any civilization. Oh, guys, what I found. I'm not in Sochi. <laughs> How could I? Experienced tourists booked a guest house, not in Sochi, but in a small village. You see, what, what is this? <laughs> I don't know even the name of this village. Ah, yes, I know. Kudepsta. Have you heard something about that? Ooh. I don't see the sea. I don't see uh, the beauty. Uh, my friends told me Sochi is so beautiful. And <laughs> And here I, I cannot even find a place to drink coffee. Fuck, sorry. <sighs> After two hours of useless walking around and wandering, I found a small cafe with beer. I don't drink beer, but it's only for you, my friends. Uh, have a liter of uh, Czech beer, 80 rubles. Sochi beer, 80 rubles. Another Sochi beer, 80 rubles. <laughs> Good prices. And I ordered at last a coffee. Two cups. Two cups of strong coffee. I'm tired. Having drunk coffee, I feel better. But I still don't understand where am I. I see the sea at last. And a railway and a not so clean river is this really a resort i wonder oh, oh. i think i'm i'm sleeping it cannot be a world famous resort 
it's something unknown for me. <laughs> Look, it's like in prison. Oh, thanks God. I will be spending here only only a few hours. Then I will leave this wonderful place. Lassers, <sighs> everything for kids and hard corn. That's all I see. And a tunnel under the railway. Not so picturesque. What do you think, my friend? Ah, yeah, fruits. Very expensive fruits and vegetables. Let's see. Oh, no. It's the prices are higher than in a grocery store. very slippery and not so picturesque <laughs> yeah. here in uh, Sochi area all the beaches are not sandy you see it's rather big not comfortable pebble pebbles everywhere to tell you the truth I don't like this resort at all because uh, I travel all around the world and this is not the best place so many people so many kids a lot of kids uh, crying and shouting I love kids but not so many um, um, and even I don't want to I'm not ready to to swim here. It all reminds me Soviet Union times uh, when our country was totally closed. But now we know what happened in the world resorts. I visited more than 70 countries and that's why I'm not fond of swimming and sunbathing here just for one two hours to shoot video and that's all enough for me i think i will spend time here in pizza the restaurant and maybe later i will make a decision to swim a little bit Massage is also here. I will check the price later. And what are the prices here in the beach restaurant? Ice cream, 60 grams, 130 rubles. <laughs> Milk cocktail, 250 rubles for a glass and fresh juice orange grapefruit apple and omix uh, 200 milliliters 250 not bad the smell is rather good and this is the open oven for baking pizza and price for pizza is about uh, middle average price 600 rubles for one big half a kilo What do I need to choose? I don't know. And there are different salads. For example, Greek salad, 300 rubles. And uh, fresh vegetable salad, 250. And uh, French fries, 
180 for 150 grams. This is not for me. I asked for for um, pizza, chicken and mushrooms. 470 grams for 570 rubles. And let's see. No, it's not mine. Это что, пицца шаурма? Да? А, кебаб пита. А через сколько чебурек будет? Через сколько? I changed my mind. No, pi no pizza. I would love to eat traditional dish. Pita with vegetables and with chicken. Fresh baked pita. 350 rubles with the garlic sauce. And onion. And with carrot, spicy carrot. Pita kebab. Pita kebab is ready. <laughs> This is my check for pita kebab, 350 rubles, I paid in a bar. And then I'm going to see the cooking. Sure. That, this is for me. Look, from the beginning. Fresh baked pita, mayonnaise sauce with the garlic and cucumbers and tomatoes yeah. so big <laughs> and chicken and again a lot of oil what about my diet? So many sauce and some pickles, onions, carrots for spicy taste. Спасибо. Okay, having eaten delicious pita kebab, I decided to to go to the beach. And what's the price for the beach? The beach is free, but if you want to have a sunbed, it costs. 300 rubles per day and a bungalow like massage bungalow 3000 rubles per day or 300 rubles per hour <sighs> people have fun here anyway Russians are used to spend vacations in Europe, in Italy, in Greece, uh, but now it's impossible because of special military operation. Yes, dog. I'll be here only for half an hour. That's why I don't want to pay for for sunbed and even for bungalow. So I think my place gonna be somewhere there near this 
man. <laughs> Not so hot. It's good. But the water is not so clean as I used to. Okay, let's try. After having rest and swim a little bit, I see I was mistaken. This is not so bad place. It's rather good beach, clean as it possible. And um, I don't like pebble, of course. It's not comfortable for me. But uh, this beach has received a special award for its clean, cleanness. Um, and they have uh, here a blue flag. It's forbidden to smoke here, only in special places. It's, it's very good. Of course, it's not, it's not Italy. <laughs> in Spain but not so bad as it seemed to me before okay people have a good day I am leaving while waiting uh, the taxi not far from the beach I found a small um, local market with the melons 100 rubles for one kilo and very very fresh and ripe watermelons uh, for example half a big big melon costs uh, 210 rubles it's 35 rubles for one kilo and plums are really nice 180 uh, rubles for kilo and local peaches they are so small and very sweet. It's 160 rubles for kilo. And cherry, the last cherry of this year, 230 rubles for kilo. And apricots, these are not really apricots, these are from Uzbekistan, not, not from this area. But it's good, 160 rubles for kilo. And this is uh, corn for sure, one piece of corn, 40 rubles. And you see what it is, you know, this is um, local sweet from nuts and uh, fruit juices, 70 rubles for one piece. It's better than all candies in the world. It's traditional caucuses. That's nice. Honestly speaking, I'm really impressed by prices here in this village. This is not Sochi, it's a suburb and the prices are really very high. Two times more than in Moscow where I live. Uh, I think it's because of great uh, amount of, uh, of tourists this year. And where is my taxi? I'm going to another place and I will show you my dear. See you later.